does the know about this make him the president? Well, he's, uh, he's a routine. Uh, Mr. President is, um, is very eager and anxious to see what we're doing, and that's precisely what um, we've come to see him on, to review the situation thus far, and um, we're on course. Are you making progress? Very well, very well, very good progress. You know, um, um, generally you find that um, the situation, when it's getting to um, the end, it appears that uh, the heat is more, and not only the heat is more before it begins to get cool. So we're on, we're on course, and I'm sure you're, you may have observed the movements that we have undertaken, you know, in the last uh, one month, and the operational engagement I've also had. That should give an indication as to um, uh, what we're doing and the fact that we're on course. In terms of what exactly? Because I know Referring to what sense, I'm saying that our prisoner engagement, the totality of our engagement, both in manpower increase as well as equipment increase and operational heightened operational engagement, the totality of it is what I'm saying is on course. Yeah. There was a marching order by the president that he should end um, insurgency and terrorism before the rainy season sets in. How far so far? No, what Mr. President said is that we must bring down the level of violence in the country within a few weeks to enable our, our farmers to go back to the farms. That is on course. I believe that um, uh, before the rains come, you will have witnessed a downward trend in the violence across the country. And I'm sure that you will attest to the fact that the heightening operational engagement has, um, has yielded positive results. So what did the President tell you today? Well, he's of course encouraging us to heighten the tempo of operation. He's satisfied with the way we've started and he wants us to maintain the tempo and increase it.